the G Way Podcast with Deacon Dirty. So what's what's you know I know the pandemic has kind of shut things down and got us a little stirred and it seemed like we we're going to move that way into 2021. Mm-hmm. Uh, like how how does uh, Ralph Daniels move now? Like what's 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 cooking? Because I know if you got 12 months to just sit and do what you're doing, you're working on something. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, no, we, you know, like the most important thing for me is the Video Music Box Collection. And okay. people who are watching, you want to donate or find out more, go to videomusicboxcollection.org. Okay. Um, that's super important because that's my legacy. You know, that's part of my legacy, Video yeah. Music Box. Um, the other parts of it is, you know, Ralph, Nick Daniels, and, you know, we got a couple of ideas that we've floating around with some documentaries mm-hmm. and um and some 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 movie related stuff okay. and um and, and and that'll come you know i think that that that's going to happen as well um uh, but for me you know it's like i had a conversation with um with the rock the bells people the other day and they were you know they wanted to get some content and i said look that's cool but i need to get the video music box collection up and running and and running at a level like how the Grammys do what they do, right. yeah, you know, yeah. or Billboard magazine does what they does, and that's what I need y'all to help me with. You know, I don't want to be just. You know, I can talk and talk, talk, talk all day, you know, mm-hmm. but I need y'all expertise and connections to get me to the point where I can do that. What can? How can y'all help me yeah. in that sense? Because this is all about preserving the culture. It's not. It's bigger than Ralph McDaniel's. This, yeah, yeah, this yeah. is preserving the culture. And so they were like, okay, we got you, Ralph. So hopefully, you know, that will, will go in another direction as well. Yeah. Well, man, I mean, definitely, uh, you know, you mentioned documentaries and I guess in, you can say biopics, man. Push for that Queen Latifah joint, bro. Yeah. Because <laughs> that's yeah. a story that I would just love, you know, because I, I was, I remember from day one or day two and just the way she killed it from then till today. Wrath of a madness. Right, right. exactly. Yeah. There you go. And, and nothing about her has wavered at any time. You know what I'm saying? Nah, nah. Yeah. She's always we. She's always been the same. You know, yeah. and um, and she's always kicked knowledge. And she's oh, she was singing all along. So when she started making singing albums, people were like, I didn't know she could sing. I'm like, nah, <laughs> she's been doing it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Ooh, ladies first. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> now, now, who do we need to talk to to get that that Juice Crew bio pick uh, popping? I think that I think that you know I think Kane is gonna be the the point person. I I I think that's what he said. Okay. You know? So yeah, Kane yeah. has been Kane has been talking about it, and um, and I think that he's gonna be the point person to make that happen. So say you go to Kane's page and say, "Yo, we ready for that?" You know. So just start, just start flooding them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because you know these artists, you know they be laying back and they be doing shows and they be doing. Like, you know, come on, Kane, let's go. Yeah. We need yeah. that. We need to know that story. You know, we need to know all of the stories. We need to know the rivalry between him and Rock, Kim. You know, we need to know yeah. all of that. <laughs> <laughs> that is Sam, for sure. The, uh, the legendary uh, Ralph McDaniels, a.k.a. Uncle Ralph. Man, I certainly appreciate you taking the time, man, to kick it with us right here on G-Way Podcast with Deacon Dirty. Um, One yeah. of the reasons why we do what we do is because of you. Man. Absolutely. Bro. Oh, thank you, brother. Thank you, man. Absolutely, thank man. You. I, I, I'm you. a hip hop fan. I love hip hop, man. So I that's why I want to go back and just see all that old stuff. I love bars, man. Y'all like lyrics, you know what cool. I'm saying? Okay. So I know the tapes are full of them, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Crazy, crazy stuff that, you know, like, you know, we know the big names and stuff, but there's certain artists that you know, for that summer, they was just hot. It's hot, and, yeah. You know? And you, you don't care, like, you still go, they, they official, because that that one that summer that they was hot, we, you know, like, that's what I try to, you know, bring back those type of artists that you might have forgot about that you go like, oh, yeah, skills. He was crazy yeah. with it, you know, yeah. or she was crazy with it, yeah. you know? Yeah. Man. Well, once again, man, where can people find you and, and get behind the, um, the, um, the nonprofit, everything you're doing? Where can they find you at? Um, on, on any social media, it's at Video Music Box, and um, the nonprofit is videomusicboxcollection.org. You know, support the culture, preserve the culture. It's super important, you know, that just not just my culture, not just hip hop, just in general, that right. we preserve our culture and our history um, so that we can tell our story correctly. Because in, 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 in 2030, the world is going to look a lot different, and we want to make sure that we are not forgotten and we don't get lost in the analog, digital, 
you know, lo, you know, transition. Exactly. So whatever it is, and if you sitting at home and you got something in your house, it might be worth something. Mm -hmm. Don't throw it away because that's what we do. Unfortunately, our people go, they move, whatever, they throw stuff out. Mm -hmm. And it's value in these things. There's somebody sitting around that would be like, damn, I'm missing a part of the story and you might have it right in your house. So. Right in your house, right. Don't even know it. Yeah. Once again, man, I want to thank you, man, for taking the time, man. Uh, love, love your story, man. Just watching from, you know, from back in the day to the day, man. You know, I, I didn't even realize you touched so many things, man. I was like, yo, dang, I didn't know that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but yeah, yeah, yeah. That, yeah. I, that I'm fans of, but I didn't know you was a part of them things. You know what I'm saying? So it's always good to meet the man behind uh, the the the. The, the, the hype and all that good stuff, man. And, yeah. you know, it, it's just an honor to have you here, man, for, for real. Nah, I appreciate it, man. Thank you, man. Big up to G Wade, uh, the, all the everything that y'all do in the podcast, and you know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a fan of of all the all everybody that's out there. You know, people that are watching, you know, continue to keep doing it. Flood the airways, get the information out, man. So I appreciate y'all having me. Yes, sir. Our pleasure, man. It's your boy G Wade holding it down, G Wade podcast, and I'm kicking it alongside with my man D Good. Y'all know what it is. The G Wade Podcast. The G Wade Podcast. Bringing you the cool interviews, the hot, hot topics, topics, and all that other crap. The, the G Wade, Wade Podcast, Podcast with, with Deacon, Deacon Dirty. Dirty.